When people think of Syracuse Lacrosse, people think of greatness. Syracuse Lacrosse is the most well-known and legendary program in the entire country, boasting 11 national championships, the most amongst all other Division I programs, as well as two Tawaraton Trophy winners and 23 players and coaches in the U.S. Lacrosse Hall of Fame. Most people in today's world don't quite understand the full history and roots behind the program that led to its unparalleled success in the lacrosse world. Syracuse Lacrosse played its first intercollegiate pro lacrosse game in 1916, led by coach Lori D. Cox, who held a 72% win percentage in his 14-year coaching career. Coach Cox was succeeded by Roy Simmons Sr., the coach who started to mold Syracuse into the premier program it is today. Simmons Sr. became famous for his coaching style, coaching his players not only to be great lacrosse players, but also great men off the field. Coaching legendary players such as Oren Lyons and Jim Brown, his reputation as a coach was fatherlike, and his players loved and respected him for this. Simmons Sr. also made sure his players stayed in touch with the roots of lacrosse around Syracuse, reminding players that to the Haudenosaunee people, lacrosse is not just a game, it is a representation of their culture, with massive religious and spiritual meaning. As Simmons Sr. retired, the coaching helm was passed to his son, Roy Simmons Jr. Simmons Jr. kept the same important philosophies that his father held, making sure his players carried the Syracuse lacrosse name with respect and building them not only as players, but good men. Simmons Jr. made frequent trips with his team to the Onondaga Reservation, teaching them about the religious and spiritual meaning of lacrosse to the Haudenosaunee people, as his father did. Simmons led the Orangemen to six national championship wins and coached numerous All-Americans such as legends Gary Gate, Pat McCabe, and Charlie Lockwood. The legacy of the Simmons name has not been lost with Syracuse Lacrosse, with coach Roy Simmons III and Ryan Simmons, who graduated in 2018. After the retirement of Roy Simmons Jr., John Desco was hired as head coach. Desco remains the current head coach for the program in his 20th year at the helm, winning five national championships and no sign of slowing down. In the program today, Native American culture has not been lost, with the Haudenosaunee flag still hanging in the locker room. Other religious aspects of the program include the motto Head, Heart, and Hustle, or HHH. This motto is something of a religious saying for the team, as it is stuck as the motto for the culture of the program and something all its players should follow. As a player on the current Syracuse team, I am surrounded by the religious aspects of the program, as well as the rich tradition of its history in the lacrosse world. Wearing the S on my chest and being a part of something as legendary as Syracuse lacrosse is a privilege not many players in the game are given, and something that should be treated with the respect it deserves.